Good morning, everybody. Good morning, NFL fans. It's your boy, BG the Cowboys Unified, with another edition of Coffee and Blunts. And on today's edition of Coffee and Blunts, we are going to talk about the NFL schedule release on May 12th. Also about the 17-game schedule versus 16 games. A little bit about the Hall of Fame game. And then especially for Dallas Cowboy fans, we want to talk about which games are you most looking forward to. And I'll share with you three games I have my eyes on, especially for the network that I know on how Cowboys fans move around. So what's popping, baby? It's your boy, BG the Cowboys Unified, man. Let's get it. All right, in case you've been living under a rock, the NFL voted in March to go from a 16-game season to a 17-game season. So what does that mean? Normally, we've had four preseason games, which now it scales down to three, and it gives the AFC Conference a home game this year and the NFC Conference an away game on the addition. So that makes sense. Traditionally, we've had 16 games. This year, we're going to have 17 games. The AFC is going to get an additional home game, which requires the NFC game teams to travel to the AFC for that 17 game. So right now we've got eight and eight. As normally all folks like to say Dallas Cowboys go every season is eight and eight. We've got eight home games. We'll have nine away games as an NFC team traveling to an AFC game. Why is this important to Cowboy fans? You ask. First of all, in August, we got a Hall of Fame game with the Steelers. That's going to count as a preseason game. So that means two other regular preseason games and then we're going to start the 17 game season on the 21 season, right? So years past, last four years, I've been to a home opener. And every year, it seems like we've played a fucking Giants. It's always a division game. So my question is for Cowboy fans today, who do you think the week one game will be? The season opener? And who will the home opener game be against the Dallas Cowboys? And so I'll share with you mine because I know for a fact Dallas has to go to L.A. to play the Chargers. So they will be in SoFi Stadium. That's important to Jerry, so hold that thought. We will play the Raiders in Dallas. That's important to Jerry because he's got his hands in the Vegas pocket stadium too as well. Oh, along with Santa Clara, along with SoFi, and along with Las Vegas, right? Through a company called Legends, ticketing, licensing, suites. That's where the big money is at. But anyway, getting back to the schedule as I digress. Please don't bring them New York Giants in for the first game, home game. Please don't do that, NFL. If I had to put my money on any team's home opener, it's going to be the Raiders versus the Cowboys week two. Week one will be in SoFi with the Chargers. Now, why do you say that, BG? Well, I hope it lands like that because I'd like to go to L.A. Then I'd like to go to Dallas the next weekend back to back. But more importantly, I know there's a lot of Cowboy fans in L.A. looking forward to that game in SoFi. And Jerry's got his hands in those sweets pockets. So don't forget. So going to the 17-game season, why did the NFL do that? Well, everything is about expansion. If you haven't been following me here, turn on the YouTube notifications, right? Turn on the Facebook notifications and follow me if you're on Instagram watching this today. Because expansion is always on the agenda. And as we connected with UK Cowboy fans and Mexico Cowboy fans, the NFL is all about expansion, i.e. a 17-game season. Oh, which, by the way, kicks in a 48% growth in revenue for players and the league through what's called a media kicker. Because, you know, they worked out all those deals with all those streaming partners like Amazon Prime. You know, you're going to have to have Amazon Prime to watch any of those Thursday night games. But as I digress, the 17-game season now for the 2021 NFL season is all about expansion. Dallas Cowboys will get eight home games. We're going to have nine away games. We're going to be playing in Canton, Ohio in the first week of August for the Hall of Fame against the Steelers. And I'm hoping that it's going to be L.A. week one and it's going to be Raiders week two. I got a question. Who do you think we're going to play week one? And then who do you think we're going to play in the home opener? Do me a favor. Leave a comment down there. Do me a favor. Like and subscribe and also follow me here. But leave me a comment more importantly. I want to know where Cowboys Nation is. Is that on this schedule, which happens to be an event release. So the NFL is doing everything to make everything, everything bigger and better, baby. It's all about expansion on the agenda. It's a 17 game season. Leave me your comments down below. Who do you want to see Cowboy fans come into week one? And who do you want us to see play at the home opener? 
And lastly, I'm looking at Tampa as an away game because it's still fuck Tom Brady. Y'all comment, like, and subscribe on this video, man. You've been hanging out with BG this morning on Coffee and Blunts. It's the NFL schedule release edition for May 12th. You got to stay tuned. We'll be live on Facebook announcing the schedule on Square Groupers. So hit the link down in the description box below and join us live on Facebook Wednesday with Square Groupers, a 360 degree streaming view of cannabis as the NFL releases its schedule on the NFL Network. And we'll see what games are going to be week one and two. Don't forget who's playing week one, who's playing week two. Leave me a comment, like, and subscribe. We'll see y'all on the next video.